Hello, welcome back to Fallout 76. And I'm at my camp. Over here in the ash heap. Just down here, just near next to Welsh Station. And what I'm doing at the moment is sort of hoovering up all the quests that I've uh, picked up, but never actually done. So here's my side quest. I've got Initiate Mysteries, Overseer's Mission, uh, Forbidden Knowledge, which is a bit boring. That's just putting technical data in the Brotherhood cache. We've done that once. What about, why do I want to do that again? And then we've got some miscellaneous ones. I thought we'd do this initiate of min I thought we'd do this initiate of mysteries. This is Riverside Manor. Let's select that. If I go to the map, Riverside Manor is up here. Um, let's just fast travel there for nine caps. This place should be full of scorched. If past experience is anything to go by. Yeah, annoyingly, I did the first part of this Initiate of Mysteries quest, but the game didn't save it. It was so annoying because it was really good. So we're pretty much just sort of finishing off things now. I think there's quite a lot to do in this. Uh, let's get up our uh, fixer. Let's reload that. Right, normally I would have been jumped by lots of Scorch, so I, I'm not sure what's going on. Is anyone else here? I can't see anyone. Alright, let's go inside. Perhaps they're all lurking indoors. And there's loads of them. But they're fairly weak though. Oh, I can hear someone. Yeah, so the first part of this quest involved running around the house looking for various clues. And we discover that I, th I think it's this woman here who used to be this radio actress who used to work with the, uh, the people who did the show the Silver Shroud. She was like trapped here when the bombs fell. And she sort of turned herself into the mistress of mysteries, like a superheroine. And we had to go and find her secret base down in the basement, which we did. Uh, another reason to do this bloody quest is that if I go to apparel, I've been carrying around this worn veil all this time <laughs> as a quest item. And you have to wear the veil in order to be able to see various clues, I think. So where are we going now? We've got to go downstairs. There's no one in here. Normally, I would have heard a dozen people, a dozen Scorch wandering around the place. Right, so we've got to get downstairs. I can't remember how to, though. Over here? That's the exit. That's all that is. Damn it. Okay, there was a secret passage. Where was it? It was like a big dining room. Was it here? I don't think it was. Right, I sort of remember that piano. Or do I? <laughs> it's so long since I've done this. I'd love to get these paintings. You can buy those in the Atom store, but I think they're a bit expensive. They're expensive to buy, but you can also pick them up. Oh, this isn't doing me any good at all, is it? Right, let's keep looking. Oh, I heard a noise then. What's going on through here? Oh, here we go. This is it. Yeah, it was this room I was after. So if you come through... Right, there's the main door. Just walk straight through here. There it is. You have to go to that. And that opens up. So this is, this is the thing I discovered in that first part of the quest. I don't think there's anything else to look at here, is there? Nah. Right, let's go downstairs. Hang on, before I go any further, I put the gun down. I'll show you this stupid veil. There we go. <laughs> it's horrible, isn't it? Absolutely horrible. Uh, whoops, yeah, we can just run through here. I think. Uh, oh, here we go. Yeah, it just took a little while to Welcome figure to itself out. Please proceed to a terminal for registration. So we've got to go to this terminal here. Let's use this. Welcome to Cryptos. Please register to create an account. New initiate registration. Oh, okay. Order of Mysteries rank initiate added. New initiate registration. Uh, beginning registration. Welcome. Unknown user. Creating new uh, user account. Done. 
dispensing login creation credentials done dispensing initiate welcome holotape done right registration is complete welcome to the order of mysteries and the instructions are listen to the headmistress's welcome when finished log into your new account if you do not have a mentor one will be assigned to you use the database queries option to search for an available mentor if you do not have a veil of secrets report to the production facility okay so at the top it's saying listen to the initiate holotape and then we have to use the fabricator to repair my worn veil okay where do we go now right i'm quite thirsty as well so i just have something to drink um bop, 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 bop. where am i going through here Is that it? Council Chamber Terminal. Unlock requires key. Where do I go? Down here. Oh, okay, there's a downstairs. Alright, this is production facility. Nice. Oh god, very elaborate down here, isn't it? Jeez. Let's look in there. Fabricator terminal. Fabrication system instructions. Hello, ladies. Meet the newest addition to our production facility, the Order of Mysteries automated fabrication system. I think it's our best invention yet. Lately, we've been spending more and more time making the routine routine items you all need. Your weapons, veils, garb. Happy to do it, but it's been keeping us from working on in, on anything new. So we've built this little guy. Just select the item you want, insert the components. And it should be able to assemble your standard gear in a couple of minutes. It's all hooked into Kryptos too, so it knows what you're authorised to make and the system can automatically report successful missions. Supplies are limited, so you can only make each item once. Let me know if you want an override on that or if you need something custom. Always happy to help. That's from Frederick. Good, and this is the services here. Welcome, Initiate. You are authorised to fabricate the following items. Uh, Veil of Secrets, okay. Good. So my wall veil has been removed. Lots of stuff happened then. And a Veil of Secrets added. Alright, so I've just replaced my worn veil with a new one. Um, Alright, authenticating with Cryptos done. Verifying components. So they found the damaged veil and they made me a new one. Good. Exit. Uh, am I wearing the new veil? Does it look any newer than the other one? I'm guessing that's the new veil. So I've now got to listen to the holotape. Did they just put it in my machine? Here we go. Uh, let's play. Hello, dear. Welcome to the Order of I'm sure you're a little nervous. I know, it's a lot to take in. But the girls wouldn't have invited you here if they didn't think you were ready. Eight years ago, I began training the girls we adopted to fight like the Mistress of Mystery, the hero I played for all those years on the radio. Does that sound a little silly? I suppose it did to me too, at first. But the world needs the Mistress. It needs people with the strength to face the darkness the will to survive against any odds. It needs you. It's time for you to join our sisterhood. The Order of the Mistresses of Mystery. You won't have to walk this path alone. For the next few months, you'll be training with one of your sisters. If you have someone you want to work with, that's fine. If not, Kryptos will assign you a mentor. And as soon as I get back, we'll sit down for tea. Just the two of us. I promise. Right, so that's Shannon Rivers, who is the actress that I told you about. So I've got to request a mentor assignment now. I'll just quickly scrap that stuff I picked up. Nice. Uh, gotta go. Well, let's listen to this. There's a holotape down there. Let's play that. Frederick Rivers, production log 212. I've started digging into Kent's old idea for a ballistic weave. 
It's ambitious, I'll give him that. Finding the right pattern is going to be... Uh, uh, oh, Shannon. Sorry, I didn't hear you come in. What are you up to, dear? Another log. <laughs> Does anyone ever listen to these? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe they'll come in handy for Janet someday. She practically runs the place now. I just tinker. You do more than that. I could never have done this without you. I know that look. What's bothering you? Well, Olivia. Our daughter is two days late. Again. Frederick, I don't know what to do with that girl. She's smart, talented. But she never listens. She won't take orders. When I try to correct her, she just storms off. Do you think you can... Dear, I love you both. I can't get in the middle of this. The two of you need to talk this out. We've always put a lot of pressure on her. She's not perfect, but she's an incredible young woman. Remember that. Yeah. Yeah, I know. It's past midnight. Come on, let's go to bed. I can finish this in the morning. Oh, quite interesting, wasn't it? So that was the husband who's um, sort of been preparing stuff for the mistress to use, all her special equipment. And they were talking about ballistic weave, which is quite uh, an important and useful bit of armour. So hopefully we'll get some of that at some point. But let's uh, use the Kryptos terminal. Uh, log in to access your account on a user, yeah. Mission board. Well, let's just go through them in order. Mission board, as a safety precaution, initiates are not permitted to accept missions from this system. When your mentor believes you are ready to operate independently, your promotion to novice will unlock this board. Initiates in need of a mentor should request one by using the appropriate database query. Okay, uh, let's look at the, let's jump to rather, database queries. Right, preset database queries are, av are available based on your rank and active missions, if any. For manual queries or for additional assistance with the system, please speak with Frederick Rivers. The following preset queries are available. Initiate mentor assignment, which is what we want. Checkpointed. Right, I've got a mentor, Mistress Natasha Hunt. Status on mission and she's in Lewisburg. Your mentor is currently on a mission. You may wait for her return or meet her in the field and her sister in the completion of her mission. Right. There we go. Let's go and meet our mentor in Lewisburg, which is what it says at the top there. Lewisburg is a horrible, ghoul-infested hellhole. So I'm very glad to be going back there, obviously. Wretched old Lewisburg. Oh God, this foe looks terrible. <laughs> I look like a Japanese businessman on the um, on the underground. You know, they wear those masks. I, th I can't remember if the Japanese businessmen wear the mask to stop them catching cold, or to stop them infecting other people if they've got a, a cold themselves. Lewisburg is a tough location, and I thought the Initiate Mysteries quest was quite an early one, so I'm surprised that the game is sending people here so quickly. First time I came to Lewisburg, I got absolutely creamed. Um, get the rifle up. Damn it! Look, completely, completely empty. My gun then, still, still saying empty. There we go. That's got twenty in it. And the last time I came here, there was some Wendingos hanging about. Oh, it's just bloody liberators. Come on, bloody liberators. No, there's loads of them. Stupid bastards. Come on. Oh dear, my shooting's not very good. Right, oh, you're down. Good. So we're going to find our mentor, who's dead, obviously. Wow, I'm picking up a lot of damage. Right, I'm genuinely surprised. Yeah, I think I underestimate Liberators sometimes. 
thing is, if it was ghouls, I wouldn't be treating them so in such a cavalier manner. Right, what's that? Right, that'll be uh, a car exploding, I guess. Something got me from over here. Where was that? Right, let's get you. Bloody hell. How did that happen? So what I've got to do, meet your mentor in Lewisburg. Reload. Oh, Verti bot now. Oh, it's all happening. Um, I wonder if my mentor is up on the roof somewhere. Uh, pop, 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 pop. All right, we got to get over where. Well, we're moving away from it now. I'm assuming she's up on the roof. I don't know. Obviously, oh, grenade then. Carries orders. Is this her? Right, let's take your grenade. Good ammo, yeah, I'll take that. Uh, 44, yeah, I won't take the other stuff. Get a nice little rifle there. A glass jar, I won't bother with that. What's, what's that ammo? What's that ammo? Oh, I can't tell. Right, let's read. Kerry, got some new intel. One of the girls will be on out your way on Thursday. Get word to Char and his boys in Big Bend. You're going to need backup. Stake out Lewisburg, set up an ambush, find a good sniper nest. And don't underestimate her. If she gets a chance to react, you're all dead. Don't screw this up, Brody. Okay. Um, and let's take that. Still saying meet your mentor in Lewisburg. Was this basically something completely different then? Good grief. I don't know where we have to go. I'm back on ground floor again. Really none the wiser as to where this woman might be. I thought that was her up there. And it's a really small area I've got to search, so why can't I find her? Anything down here? Cutting board? There we go, look, here's someone. Natasha Hunt. Ah, oh, she's wearing that dress, so that's that's what I've got to watch out for. Because we've seen a corpse wearing that type of dress before. I can hear something. Is that a rad rat? Oh no, it's another bloody thingy. Uh, let's take that. Take that. Take all the stuff. Good morning. I'm sorry to drop this off you. Tiana hasn't reported in from her last mission. Olivia and I are heading out to investigate. I have a lead on a raider scouting party. I need you to follow up on it. Standard protocol. Secure the location, look for signs of raider activity, and report back to the manor. Be careful, dear. I can't bear to lose anyone else. Right, I got a report to Kryptos. That was it, was it? <laughs> okay, let's go back again. I'm hearing sounds. I think the scorched are back. Pinch that phone. Thank you. Go through here. As far as I remember, um, the mistress had like recruited all these orphan girls and so like bloody hell. Like turned them into um, copies of her. What was that? Thought I heard something there. Right, let's go and have a look. Right, what do I do? Do I log in as unknown user or log in as Mistress Natasha Hunt? Let's try going straight for Mistress. Right, mission board. Okay. Right, as a safety precaution, initiates are not permitted to accept missions from this system. Yada yada, we've read that already. Okay, let's come out. Let's go back in as unknown user. Mission boards, mission reports. Let's look at that. The automated mission reporting system is still in development. For instructions on who to report your missions to, please consult the handbook. 
database queries. Uh, preset database queries are available based on your rank and active missions. So the following preset queries are available, which we've already done. That's a mentor assignment. Which is the, uh, the handbook. Jesus, look at all this. Um, okay, from Headmistress Rivers. Ah, oh, blimey. I never thought I would be part of something like this all my life. I was just an actress playing the part of a hero on the radio. But everything changed after the war. There were so many people in need, you girls most of all. Frederick and I were glad to adopt you and share what we could. Food, shelter and training, my old acting turned survival skills. But this world needs more than survival, it needs heroes, it needs you. In these past few years, you have shown me that together. As sisters, you can accomplish things that even the mystery, mistress of mystery could never have imagined. Mission statement. The Order of Mysteries is a sisterhood dedicated to upholding the virtues exemplified by the mysteries, mistress of mystery, courage, cunning and compassion. We fight in the shadows to protect ourselves, one another and the people of Appalachia from any threat to their lives or liberty. The Mistress of Mystery. Ah, oh, bloody hell. The Mistress of Mystery is one of the longest running and most popular superheroes in the Hubris Comics canon. First appearing in Hubris Heroes number 8, 2039, the Mistress of Mystery has been featured in hundreds of comic books, radio broadcasts and other properties and licenses, including a weekly newspaper strip between 2052 and 57, five novels and several lines of action figures. Or I'm ignoring the creepy sounds. In August 2077, it was announced that the mistress would also... Okay, I can't ignore that. Back, 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 exit. What the hell's going on? What the bloody hell? Is this someone upstairs? Look at the map. Oh, if there is someone... Oh, there is... There's someone else upstairs. At level 65. All right, let's ignore them. Uh, unknown user... Where was I? Database queries. No, it wasn't that, was it? Handbook. Uh, Mistress of Mystery... Okay. Oh, God almighty. Right, um, in August 2077 it was announced that the mistress would also have a major role in the upcoming live-action Silver Shroud television show, her first appearance on screen. Born Claudia Martin, the daughter of American archaeologists, her young life was torn apart when her parents mysteriously vanished while investigating the lost pyramid of amun -Ri. Orphaned and alone, she was forced to survive by her wits on the streets of Cairo until she was adopted by a wealthy heiress. On her 18th birthday, she came into possession of her parents' effects and set out to learn the truth behind their disappearance. Delving into a dark, we into a web of ancient legends, occult societies, and dark intrigues. The Mistress of Mystery is a confident, quick-thinking, and capable hero. Instead of superhuman or mythical powers, she relies on her skill, training, cunning, stealth, and subterfuge to overcome her foes. Although she often operates alone. She has appeared alongside many of Hubris Comics' other heroes over the course of her career, most notably the Silver Shroud, her lifelong friend and former love interest, Ua, the Inspector, her partner in the Mysterium mystery serials, and most recently the rest of Hubris's greatest heroes on the team of the Unstoppables. Uh, so I think that's people like um, Grognak and Manta Man and things like that. The Mistress of Mystery has been drawn by over 30 artists, notably Tara Winters, Kelly Donovan and Lucille Perkins. The iconic radio voice of the Mistress of Mystery is Shannon Rivers. Ah, bloody up the regalia of mystery. Jesus. In addition to her skills and training, the Mistress of Mystery drew, drew upon an arsenal of powerful tools to aid her in her work. The veil of secrets shields the mistress's face, cloaks her identity and hones her senses. It also protects her from a range of threats, including poison gas, smoke and fumes. The garb of mysteries is the mistress's formal gown. Though it took a variety of styles over the years, the garb was carefully crafted to provide her with unhindered movement. 
Jesus. Enhancing her stealth and speed. The Phantom Device is a tool for infiltration, creating a cloud of disorientating smoke to conceal the mistress while she makes her daring escapes. Oh, it goes on. The Blade of Bastet is the mistress's legendary sword, a weapon of heroes handed down through the ages, capable of piercing any armour or barrier. The blade is lighter, faster and stronger than any lesser weapon. The Voice of Set is the iconic 44 revolver wielded by the mistress. Its array of powers included the ability to fire bullets that exploded into noxious smoke, disable electronics or disrupt magical fields. The Eye of Ra was the mistress's greatest relic, a jeweled brooch that allowed her to draw upon the full extent of her abilities in the most dire of trials. Ranks and promotion. Oh, they're taking the mickey here a little bit, aren't they? The Order of Mysteries has the following ranks. Initiate. The Order of Mysteries has the following ranks. Initiates are the newest member of the Order. Initiates work full time with their mentor to learn basic skills and mission tactics. When they've proven that they are capable of handling missions independently, a mentor will approve their promotion to novice. Novices continue to train under their mentor and the Mistress of Novices working to master the tools and techniques of the Mistress of Mystery. In order to advance to the rank of Seeker, they must complete a series of capstone missions to earn the elements of the Mistress's regalia. Seeker study advanced combat tactics as they prepare for their final test, a mission worthy of the true Mistress of Mystery. After completing their mission, they may apply to the Headmistress for promotion. A Mistress of Mystery is a full member of the Order, a master of stealth, infiltration, combat and tactics, capable of handling herself in any situation. The Mistress of Novices is the second in command of the Order, <laughs> responsible for organising and assigning missions and coordinating training programmes. The Headmistress is the leader of the Order of Mystery, the first amongst equals she inspires and guides the Order in achieving its goals. God help us. Missions and Mission Reports uh, Members of the Order of Mysteries undertake missions commensurate with their skills and experience. Missions may be assigned by a more senior member of the Order or accepted from Kryptos Mission Board. Initiates report to their mentor who will review and access, assess their progress and approve their promotion to the rank of Novice. Novices may accept missions from the Mission Board if for the automated missions associated with their regalia they report to their mentor and the mistress of novices. Seekers and mistresses report directly to the headmistress or to the mistress of novices if the headmistress is unavailable. I hope this is completely clear to everyone. Our membership roster. Headmistress Shannon Rivers. Mistress of novices Eve Devois. Mistresses of mistress, sorry, mistresses of mystery. Catherine Adams, Sarah Burnett. Tiana Chevrel, Kaylee Evans, Lucia Haynes, Natasha Hunt. Oh god, there's more. Evelyn Jackson, Alison Long, Van oh, I'm not going to read these names. And the Seekers are... Well, again, I don't think they're important. Oh there's, god, there's more of them. Novices. Cora Belmont, that rings a bell for some reason. And the technical specialist is Frederick Rivers. About Headmistress Rivers. Hang on, have we not seen that already? Oh no, we haven't, no. Shannon Rivers, 2024 to... Bleh, was born in Beckley, West Virginia. After an early career in regional and touring theatre, Miss Rivers made her radio debut in 2047's Invaders from Planet Z. She quickly earned a reputation as gifted and versatile actress, starring in numerous radio dramas and serials. 2051, she began her long-running role as the radio voice of the Mistress of Mystery. Miss Rivers is well known for her advocacy, advocacy of charitable causes, especially issues affecting the economically depressed residents of Appalachia. 2053, she married Frederick Rivers, noted inventor and architect. They have a daughter, Olivia. Right, so the quest I've got now in the top right-hand corner of the screen is find a way to authorise your own promotion. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to go back to the roster. So Olivia, where is she? All oh, right. So Olivia Rivers was a. Let's have a look. She's a mistress. So that's the mistress of mystery list. 
Yeah, and Olivia's there, okay. And I think we found, I think we find her body in one of the houses around here. I remember finding a body, I think it might have been Olivia. That's where we got the veil from initially. Right, let's get some water down us. Right, had some water and a bit of food, but I'm, I'm down to one tin of canned dog food. A bit worrying. Right, some idiot's playing the piano. Right, uh, Kryptos Terminal. Do we go here? Log in as Mistress Natasha Hunt, I suppose. Oh, what do I do? Mission board. Done all that. Mission reports. Uh, sort the handbook it says, daily ways queries. Error, unable to re retrieve a list of valid queries for using Natasha Hunt. Please contact production for assistance. Uh, administrative actions, this might be it. Right, authorised promotion, here we go. Um, what I'll do, hang on, look at this one first. Register as mentor. Please select an unassigned initiate to mentor. Yada yada, authorised promotion, this is what we want. Yep. Unknown user, that's what we want, that's me. Completed, excellent. Log in to claim your promotion. Let's come right out again, let's see if this does it. Right, this is very bureaucratic, isn't it? Can I log in again? Log in as unknown user. Congratulations, unknown user. You have now earned the title of Novice of Mysteries. As a novice, you will continue to train with your mentor and the mistress of novices as you work to master the skills, tactics, and combat techniques of the mistress of mystery. Authorizing the fabricated to dispense garb of mysteries. Done. Dispensing novice rank holotape. Done. Please listen to the headmistress's message. Right, so let's go and find uh, the fabricator, which is downstairs, wasn't it? Fabrication services. Oh, it didn't say anything. Um. Oh, well, hang on, how do I get my... It says log in to claim my promotion, which I did. I logged in. Okay, log in as an unknown user. Now it's dispensing novice rank holotape. Done. Please listen to the headmistress's message. So, novice rank holotape. Is it not giving me the holotape? Order of Mysteries. Oh, where is it? That's, I'm on the production log. It's not that one. That's the Initiate. But that's the only one I can bloody well see. It wouldn't be anywhere else. Play that. Hello, dear. Welcome to the Order of Mysteries. Oh no, we've, we've sure listened to that one. Nervous. Try it again. Ah, bollocks. Oh, I said continue then. Checkpointed. Oh, bloody hell, I just had to press... Uh, I pressed X to continue. And now it's added the novice rank. Oh, that was just... Bloody complicated. Bloody complicated, thank you. I've got some bloody diluted ran away, some bloody bullet. Yeah. Quest completed, initiate of mysteries. Well, that was bloody... <laughs> I went all around the houses just to... Oh. Yeah, quest started, novice of mysteries. Great. That, I mean, to fill you in, I, I, I cut around a lot of this, but I thought the game was broken, and that bastard was making loads of noise as well, so I, I sort of logged out, and then came back in again. But, oh, what a pain in the bum. And all I had to do was just, on that page, press X to continue. Right, let's go and get some garb. 
Here we go. Fabricator terminal use. Uh, services and oh, a novice garb of mysteries. Okay. Super. Right, so I've got a garb apparently. I don't have to wear it, do I? Item reward garb of mysteries. Hopefully, I don't have to wear a bloody dress. Listen to the novice holotape. All right, let's do that now. Here we go. Congratulations, dear. I'm sorry I can't be with you today. But I'm sure the other girls can walk you through your vows. Things have been difficult for us of late. In eight years, we only lost one member of our family. In the past three months, we've lost seven. All to raider ambushes. I've asked Eve to accelerate our training program. If the worst should happen, we need everyone to be ready. In order to become a full member of the Order, you will need to master the tools of the Mistress of Mystery. Sword, Shot, and Shadow. Work with Eve and your mentor. When the time comes to prove yourself, Kryptos has the details. Right, so we've got lots of things to do here. Earn the Phantom Device, earn the Blade of Backstead, earn the Voice of Set. So let's go through here. We've got to master them all as well. Uh, right, we've got to log in here again, do we? Cryptos Terminal. Log in as unknown user. Mission Board, I think, is what we want. Oh, yeah, the Phantom Device. Let's do that. Please review the mission briefing for your instructions. Okay. So to the Phantom Device holotape. Come out. Quest started chasing shadows. Uh, assemble the Phantom Device. You're right, yeah, good, good. Um, let's listen to this holotape first. Phantom device. First and foremost, the Mistress of Mystery was a master of stealth, subterfuge, and infiltration. Your own talent and training are essential. But there were times when even the Mistress needed more. Part smoke bomb, part cloaking field. The Phantom device threw her foes into disarray while she made her most daring escapes. Frederick has found a way to make a real phantom device, but it requires two components we have in short supply. Search Kryptos for leads on stealth boys and hallucinogen gas. Use your training to infiltrate your targets, secure the items, and return them to the production facility. Good luck, dear. And be careful. Okay, good, good, good. Use. Uh, unknown user. What do I do now? Um, database queries. Right, yeah, okay. Um, phantom device components. Checkpointed. Uh, running preset query phantom device components. Searching database for stealth boy. Done. Mission log. Right, we can find one at the North Cutthroat Camp. Searching database for hallucinogen gas, done. Uh, we, that indicates that we can find it at Garaham Mining Headquarters. Please acquire the components and return them to the production facility for processing. Let's have a look on the old map. There's a cutthroat camp is over here, I think, is it? Yeah, there it is. We've been there a few times. Uh, let's get a central mountain lookout. You got the lookout. It's up in the Savage Divide. So I don't know who we're going to find here. It's normally robots at this particular camp. Oh, I don't need to crouch so much, do we? Hallucinogen gas you find all over the place. But they suggest we have to go to Garahan Mining Headquarters. Crouch down. Yeah, there's bloody robots. Um, 
What are they? Oh, Colonel Guts is as well. Bastards. Right, let's call up. Anti armor Gatling. That normally works quite well on these fellas. Reloads. Yeah, I'm not exactly running out of ammo. I've got 240 rounds, but this thing does eat it up somewhat. What grenades have I got? Oh, come on. Plasma grenades, they're not the best. Look at our weapons. I've got any pulse grenades, that's what I really want, a pulse mine. That might be useful. How many are there? Um, let's get up our fixer. Have a look, come on. One, two. There's another one up there. Are these all, they're all kernels. Damn it. Um. Right, let's, so let's not do that. Let's get our pulse mine activated. If we can put that somewhere convenient and then encourage the little bastards to chase me. I don't want to do that. Come on. Here we go. Tee hee. They didn't seem very interested in me though, did they? Stop that. Let's let's get a um, furious up. I've only got eight balls though. Where is he? No, I don't want that one. Let's just try and manual shot on you. Right, did a little bit of damage. Not much. Not nearly enough. Again, they're, they're really quite inactive, aren't they? <laughs> Lazy sides. I'm in caution, though. Let's get down here. Oh, a Lieutenant Gutsy. Oh, I missed. I can't believe it. I thought they were all colonels. There's a colonel. Yeah, he went down and went very well. Right, they spotted me. Is he going to land on that mine? Right, there we go. Good. I'd prefer it if the other one had gone on there. Um, let's get our grenades up. Plasma grenades. How many of these have I got? Another pulse mine. Have I got another one? What's in I two? What's that? Oh, you're a colonel. Right. He's scuppered. That was a sneak attack. Won't be so lucky the next time. Down he goes. Oh, he's still got some life in him. Come on. Let's get the other gun up. Come on. Good. Uh, let's get Mr. Gatling up. Anti armor Gatling. Jump, jump. How many are there? Oh, there's a few of them. Look. Oh, that's the lieutenant. There's another colonel. Let's get our mine up. Oh, the mine's gone. Irritating. Stop it. Come out. What's that going to do? Is that going to get... Oh, Alright, let's see if we can just chuck that over there. Oh, he's down. Well done. Let's get the other one. Ah, oh, crap. Too far. Come on. That's it. Go. I think we can get you fairly straightforward, you know. I think. Let's get another grenade up. Is that going to work? Oh, crap. Oh, no. Did pretty well. Oh, 
can't see the cursor. Here we go. Down he goes. Alright, let's go and get this other stuff. What was it here? Hallucigen or something? Anything useful there? No. Take the hot plate. Here we go. Oh, jeez, I'm going to unlock it. Right, this is to prevent you just running in and grabbing, I suppose. Oh, bollocks. Come on. It's up here. Nice. Jake's letter, stealth boy. Well, let's read this letter. Hey, Snake, Boss Thorpe sent Kara, Hawk, Bones and me down to man the checkpoint on the old highway. It ain't bad. Real solid built prime location. Stories about this place give me the creeps, though. You hear about Max crew. Hawk said they were all wiped out one night, no warning at all, just some lone assassin. Brody was the only survivor. Had to limp all the way back to Pleasant Valley. Sure feel better with a crack shop like you on our side. It's been slim picking so far, but I'm sure there'll be some caravans through here once the weather turns. Do you want in on this? Yeah, not really. Uh, still boy. Do that. Surveyor's outfit, I'll have that. Quite nice. Right, boop, boop, through here. Get that rid of that. Got a grenade on you? No, just some gunpowder. Right, I'll have a quick scoot around, do some looting. Right, had a look around. Couldn't find anything to eat at all. Uh, I will need some food soon. I'm trying to remember if there's any mole rats around here. I think there are. Um, pop, 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 pop. what should we do? There's a trader down there. The station. I can always go and buy some food. Oh, we don't need it yet. Let's go back to. Oh no, we got to locate the hallucinogen gas, which is all the way down here. Uh, so there we go. Right there. What I'll do, I'll fast travel to my home, and then hop over. Okay, here we are at Garahan, and this will either be super mutants or mole miners, I reckon. And it looks like we've got to get right downstairs, so this could be quite a tough fight. Irritatingly, I don't know, don't know how many people will be down here. I can't see anyone. Oh, Feral Ghoul Reaver. If it's just a bunch of ghouls, we should be okay. Um. I've got my Gatling gun up. Stop that! <laughs> Damn it. Come on, crouch down, crouch down. And get your lovely fixer up. Come on. There's another one over there, look. Down he goes. Someone over there. Oh, with the feral. That's you. Get you though. Oh, you actually are a 52. Come on. Damn it. Okay. I was trying to hold it steady, but I was moving backwards. Let's go downstairs. Reload. Whoa, run away! Damnation! Oh. I mean, I, I should know that. <laughs> I've been caught out by that before. But it's been such a long time since I came here. I'd forgotten. Right, well, we know this is clear now, don't we? Let's do some vaxing. Now, there might be a ton of bastards behind here, or hardly anyone at all. Turn the radio off for a start. Don't want that dirge on. Right, let's have a look. And while I was fast travelling over here, I stopped off at home and made myself some corn soup and made some more lead balls for me musket. That's very good. Why have I got two quest markers up? All right, okay, um, the other quest markers for the main novice of mysteries. I'm doing Chasing Shadows at the moment, aren't I? All right, more ghouls. Oh, 
Ooh, a fiddle rotting one. Let's just vax him. Mind you, hang on, I'll get my sword up as my secondary weapon. It cuts through ghouls like no one's business, that bloody sword, it's brilliant. Keep going. Oh, I'm hungry now, yeah, I thought I would be. Let us get some food down us. Right, there's someone down there. Well, they're going down easy enough. Very gratifying. I shouldn't be using vats, I should be concentrating on me marksmanship, but there we are. Okay, through here. Where's someone? Come on. Caution. Right, let's get this sword up. Sword up. Sword up. Oh, take your time. Look at my bloody health. Jesus. Uh, oh, I'll take all that. Oh, I won't take the rounds. Damn, I have to get through here. Request a government airdrop now, it's saying. Through here as well. Let's have a look. Oh, it's in the safe. Okay. Get in there. Good, good. Nice. Take all that as well. What was that? Are you, are you alive? You are as well. Look. That's your right. Look, he was a little mini boss to beat. <laughs> He's completely asleep. <laughs> All right, All right wins. Yeah, we know that. Civic Centre booth key. All right, I don't know if we've picked that up already. Might as well hoover this stuff up. Take, oh, I don't want the bell really. Tarberry. What's in here? Oh, yeah, I'll take it. Black powder pistol. Watch my weight though. Looks very nice here, doesn't it? What was that? What was that? Ski sword? Yeah, I'll have that. Dictol. Oh, what a lot of nice stuff in here. Scissors. Printer. Alright, I'm in caution still, so I can't just fast travel out here. We can just clear off though, I'm sure. Hidden now. What do these guys have on them? Got some caps. Caps and chalk. Buff tats. Yeah, nice stuff. Oh, I'm glad I looked. Let us clear off. Now we've got to go and use the fabricator to make the phantom device. Let us fast travel the hell out of here. Yeah, typically, those are the little bastards around. Can we just avoid them? Down we go! It's like home sweet home, this place, isn't it? Come on. Welcome, right, I want to use the fabricator. Down, down, down. Here we go. Can't remember what I'm making. Oh, it's the phantom device, isn't it? Of course it is. Use. Services. Phantom device. Nice. So presumably I can just equip that now. Right, so I've got... The next things to do are to earn the blade of Bastet. Earn the voice of Set, and then master the tools. But I think we will do that next time. Because even with a lot of judicious editing, <laughs> this is going to be a very long episode. I've leveled up, that's quite good. Enjoying that.
So anyway, I hope you enjoyed it too. I hope you come back for some more very soon. And until I see you again, I shall say goodbye.